Sweetheart, it's not as bad as it looks. S slow down, I just got back from the mission, okay? Sweetheart, it's nothing, it's nothing. Even though Director Eckert insists that I should get it checked out, even though it really is just nothing. Ow! Ow! Ugh. Just calm down, hon. It's just a small bruise. I fell down the stairs and landed on my side. Babe, look, it's fine. Just clean it up and I'll be on my way. Thank you. No, I'm not clumsy. Just because I fell down the stairs doesn't mean I'm clumsy. Yes, I know it's your job. I also have my job to get back to as well. Do I really have to lay down on the bed? Can I just get back to work, please? Ow! Why did you flick my forehead? Fine. Ugh. This is gonna take forever. You know, you're just like my mom. Always nagging at me. I know you do it because you love me, and I know she did it because she loved me. I know. I'm sorry, okay? It was just a long day. The mission was complicated, to say the least. This new job is so fast-paced. Two months ago, I was just a less than a normal high school kid, and now it's all been non-stop. Just non-stop running and gunning, taking care of bad guys, and saving the day. I know if I was more careful, I wouldn't be here. Besides, I'm still new at this. At least cut me some slack. Ever since I got here, I've had to impress the other agents, gain their trust, learn from the director, all the while trying to maintain my school life too. Keeping the fact that I'm a secret law enforcement agent for my friends at school wasn't in the job description when I first got recruited. Yeah, I know you've been doing the same, longer than I have. Right. At least your job sounds a lot less crazier than mine. <laughs> Ow! Ow! Careful, hon, that stings. Look, can I go now? I still have work left to do. I gotta write these reports, you know. You know how the director is. He's practically obsessed with getting his reports. And if I don't write them before the end of my shift, he's going to throw a fit. You know I'm not trying to avoid you. You want to cuddle with me in this small bed? Okay. You should probably lock the door before someone comes in. Here, just lay your head on my chest. There we go. Are you comfortable? Your hair is all over my face. <laughs> Are you even done patching up my bruise? Yeah, you're right. It'll wear off. Look, thank you. I can always count on you for being there for me, even if I'm being a jerk sometimes. Now I can see why you didn't want to be a field medic. Being a field agent is stressful. You want to go somewhere this weekend? What did you have in mind? I was thinking we could go to the beach before the fall season comes around and starts getting cold. Yeah. Ocean City would be fun. I would love to go on the boardwalk again. What? What is it? Why are you looking at me like that? Wow. You're really cute. Gosh, I'm really lucky to have you. Okay, okay. Babe, I have to get back to work. These reports aren't going to write themselves, you know. Baby, stop. <laughs> stop. Stop. Stop it. Don't give me those googly eyes. Rain up. Rena, what are you doing? <laughs> okay, okay. I'll lay down with you for five more minutes. Come here, love. 
I love you. I said I love you, silly. <sighs> yeah, you're very beautiful. <sighs> Man, I'm tired. Yeah. Director, is that you? Yeah, she's patching me up still. I'll be on in a minute. Baby, stop it. What are you doing? Hey, stop. Stop. Yes, yeah, sir. I'm tracking. Roger that, sir. Baby, stop it. Got it. Got it. Raina, what are you doing? Baby, I know. Babe, look, I'll never get these reports done if you don't let me go. Okay, once I'm done, we'll go straight home and I'll cook you your favorite noodles. When will I be done? It won't take more than 20 minutes, I promise. Yes, I promise, sweetheart, I love you. Okay, I'll finish these up, all right? Okay. Yes, sir. Henry, Davis, and Quintus were relieved of their shift earlier, and they filled out the after-action report, and I'm just writing up my final statements now. I will send them out to you in the next 10 minutes. Yes, sir. Raina? She did good, patching me up, like she always does. She's the best anyone can ask for. Yeah, I'm grateful to have her. She's a great girlfriend. Okay, understood, sir. I will. Good night, sir. Come in. Hi, honey. I'm almost done. Just finishing up some details. I know, hon. Just a couple more minutes. Ow! Ugh. Why are you checking out my wounds? I'm okay, love. Baby, ow! Ow, ow. That, that hurts. I'm not being a baby. <sighs> I told you, sweetheart. I fell down a set of stairs. It was dark. I couldn't see anything. Henry told you the rest, didn't he? Yeah. He never seems to keep his mouth shut about a lot of things. Luckily, the fall happened after we secured the building. There. I'm done. What? Why are you pouting? Baby, I told you. Director Eckert wanted these reports done. Babe, d don't. Don't give me that look again. 
the look with the puppy sad eyes. That look. The look with... Okay. You're being very, very dangerously cute right now. <sighs> Come on, honey. Let's go home together. You still want me to cook you noodles, right? With bean sprouts and cut beef? Okay. Yes, yes, I won't forget the cilantro. Hey, listen. This new job. Operating and kicking down doors. Taking down the bad guys. It's still new to me. I'm still trying to adjust to things here. I've been here two months, and I'm already struggling trying to keep this a secret from everyone. I mean, no one told me I was going to be a secret agent still in high school. And also, being the leader for a Raven team is also a very big task. I'm not sure what the director sees in me. Thank you, Reyna. That actually means a lot. I promise I'll come to you if I ever need anything. Our jobs are very similar. At the end of the day, we're both trying to make a difference in each other and others' lives. I promise I'll be careful next time. No more falling off stairs. Yes, I promise. We will be okay. Come on. Let's go home. Dad. Um. Uh. Mm. No. No. Um. Baby, baby, I, I'm okay. I'm okay. Are you okay? I'm sorry. I must have scared you. Jesus. God, I am, I am so sorry, honey. Are you okay? It, it, it was nothing, baby, I'm okay. It was nothing. It was just a bad dream, love. Come on, let's just go back to sleep. It was nothing, love. Baby? Baby, where are you going? You didn't have to make me a glass of water, honey. Thank you. Do I want the fairy lights on? Yeah. Turn them on, please. I'm okay, baby. I don't think I need anything else. I'm sure. I, I kind of don't want to talk about it, baby. Come on, let's go back to sleep. Baby? What is it? Why are you poking me? Hi, honey. You're very pretty. Can I... 
Can I hold your hand? Your hand is so warm. Right. The dream. The dream. It was about my parents. Yeah, it was just images and blurs of them fading away from me. But it all felt so real. I guess I still haven't been able to get past the trauma when they... Every time I think of them, I keep going back to our last conversation between my parents and I. It... It wasn't even... It wasn't even a conversation. It was this huge argument. I can't even remember what it was about. I've tried to remember. Maybe if they didn't leave to go to the store and just stayed for a few more minutes, I would have remembered what it was. Maybe they wouldn't have... I know, baby. I still feel like it's all my fault. If I would just listened to them and been better, if I was just a good son to them, maybe they would have... Your hugs are always so warm. Thank you. I love you so much, baby. Hmm? What did you say? you want me to remember something good about them? Mm. <laughs> remember when you first met my mom? She gave you a really big hug and she was saying you looked very pretty and beautiful but you can understand what she was saying because her English was broken? <laughs> she took you upstairs to her bedroom and she let you try her dresses. It was the, uh, the red one she let you try on. Gosh. You were so beautiful. Yeah. She loved you so much. Mom treated you like the daughter she never had. <laughs> and Dad. Dad, he was always cautious. Cautious about me. Dad was always making sure I was taking good care of you. Mom, too. They loved you a lot, I just wish they were... I just wish they were still... <sighs> Give me a hug again, baby. Your body... Is so warm. This feeling... I love it when you play with my hair. Thank you, Reyna. You make me feel so safe. I don't want to let you go. You're all I have left. I don't know what I would do without you. This job, it's sort of ironic. I'm pretty much facing death every time I go on a mission. But on the bright side, I have you to take care of me if something happens to me. <laughs> I know, I know I shouldn't say stuff like that. You always get mad at me every time I get scratched up after missions. But to be fair, that's what the job entails. Okay, I'll stop scaring you. You should have told the director to not put me as a field agent if you're going to be this worried about me. I can take care of myself, honey. <laughs> yeah, you're right. I'm always in your medical office, but that's just because I love seeing you at work. It's a good thing you have those blinds in the office. You know, 
so we can have some alone time together. Away from the usual chaos, hmm? <laughs> I love you, sweetheart. Yes, I remember my promise to you. And I'm still not clumsy. <laughs> no, I'm not. No, I'm not. Stop. Go back to bed, honey. <laughs> you are so beautiful. Just keep holding me, okay? I'll dream of you this time. Being with you always makes everything okay. Oh, by the way, I'm sorry I couldn't cook noodles tonight for you. I promise I'll make them for you tomorrow, okay? I forgot I ran out of the broth. I'll go to the store after school tomorrow, okay? I promise, baby. Now, get some sleep. Hey guys, are we here? Welcome back. Just a little bit of a warning before we get started. This video is not recommended for sleeping because of the amount of loud sound effects that it has. This is my most edited video so far. Hope you guys enjoy and thank you guys so much for the support on our latest two episodes. I really appreciate it. Alright, let's get into it. Yep, there's the warehouse. Phoenix Actual, this is Raven-01. Raven team is outside the target building. Ready to proceed, over. Roger that. Raven team, going dark. Alright. Night vision on. Davish, cover high. Quintus, get your breaching kit ready. And Henry, watch your backs. Let's move. Alright, remember, we want this guy alive, but we are authorized to eliminate him if he's too dangerous to be captured. Everyone tracking? Alright, Quintus, the door is all you. Going interior. We'll split up. Henry, with me. Quintus and Davish, go the opposite way. If anyone finds the target, ready each other before engaging. Let's move. Quintus, anything on your end? Nothing? Okay. Keep us posted. We're entering the next sector of the building. Movement! Down the hall! This is zero one. Possible suspect heading east towards the rear of the building. Come on, Henry. Let's go. Down this hall. Huh? Watch out! This is zero one. We are taking fire on the east side of the building. All ravens consolidate on me. Jesus Christ, how many shooters do we have? Three shooters, 25 yards down the hall. Shit, we gotta return fire. Quintus, Davis, you're here. The target's down the hall, I think. He's in there pretty good. We gotta push forward. Henry, move with me. Quintus Davis, cover us! I'm tossing a flashbang! Team, I'm pushing up! Lay down some fire! What is that? Oh shit! Grenade!
Ugh. Ugh. Jesus Christ. Ugh. Ugh. Careful. 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 Ugh. Ugh. <sighs> Director, sir. I'm okay. I'm just... Ugh. Ugh. Yep. Easy. The target, sir? The target? He's dead. He didn't give us much choice. Ugh, Jesus. A grenade almost blew us all to hell. The target was about to finish us off. But Quintus here saved us. Like I said, sir, we didn't have a choice. Ugh, damn. Raina? I don't know, she looks mad. Raina? Raina, Raina, whoa, whoa, wait, 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 wait! Ow! Sweetheart, what was that for? Shut up, Henry, don't laugh. And Raina, you didn't have to hit that hard. I'm... I'm okay. My head really hurts, though. No, I didn't fall down a set of stairs. A grenade almost brought the hallway down on us. I know, I know. I know. Davis, Quintus, Henry, you guys go get checked out by the other medics. Hi, Director. Yes, Director, I understand. I'll write your report as soon as I'm fixed up. Don't you worry. What about the rest of the scene? Yes, sir. I'll let you worry about that. Okay, okay. Honey, be careful. My arm is kind of sore. Baby, I'm okay. Okay, okay, I'll sit down. It's just bruises and scratches, sweetheart. Nothing serious. What? I have a cut on my cheek? Stitches? Great. Can we do this when we get back, honey? Get a bandage over it or something. But, but yes, ma'am. I'll just sit here and let you do your thing. You're so focused and determined. I think that's really hot of you. Ow! Why'd you flick my forehead? I'm not being a baby. Yes, ma'am. Wow, putting your hand on my chin is so hot. What? What eyes? No, I'm not complicated, Reyna. Okay, fine, you're right, but sometimes I'm not. Yeah, there's a lot of bruises. The debris almost buried us alive. I'm guessing the structure wasn't stable enough. Stella's intelligence brief stated it was abandoned for years. Yes, sweetheart, I'm... Why'd you stop? Is something wrong? Baby, what's wrong? Baby? Why are you crying? Baby, talk to me, baby. What's wrong? I could have been killed today. Oh, baby, I'm still here, sweetheart. Shh, shh. No, what is? I'm still here. We are still here. Tonight was just bad, is all. Marina, here. Let me wipe your tears off. Here, give me your hand. I'll hold it. It's okay. This is what we do. This is the job. You're the best medic this unit has ever asked for. And as long as you're here, everything will be okay. Everything will be okay, I promise. I'm still here. Shh, shh. It's okay, Reyna. Here, take this bandage. My arm has a cut. Take it. Just place it right there. 
There you go. Good girl. You've done a great job, honey. Come here, I'll give you a hug. I love you always, sweetheart. Yes, I'm okay. Compared to the dude we were supposed to get, I'm okay. Having a building get dropped on top of me isn't the worst thing that's happened. You remember when I had to carry Henry out of a fire? Yeah, that wasn't fun. Okay, well, maybe it was worse, but still. Both situations were bad. Hey. Hey, Reyna. Look at me. We're gonna be okay, you and I. Yeah, we will be. We still got a lot of things to do, remember? Like that getaway trip we were talking about to Ocean City? And I still have to make you noodles. Yes, baby, I will soon. Payday is soon, so I'll go all out in the food, okay? Now, look, just finish up so we can get out of here. It's getting really cold. Just be careful about the- Ow! The open wounds. <laughs> Ow. It's okay, baby, come here. Hey guys! What's up? No, we... We were just finishing up. Sh shut up, Henry. We weren't... We weren't... She was just checking me out, is all. Yeah, yeah, whatever y'all say. So did forensics find anything? Just a bunch of drugs and unregistered weapons? We'll hand that into the ATF. Yes, sir. We'll return to base. Close out for the night. Raina and I will ride together in the ambulance. Yes, Henry, so I can spend time with my lovely girlfriend away from you knuckleheads. Now come on, let's get out of here. You okay, baby? Yes, I know. I will be careful next time. Thank you. Come on, sweetheart, let's go. I'm home, sweetheart. Sweetheart? Ah, there you are. <laughs> of course, you're sleeping. I bet the director had to do a lot tonight, huh? Ah. <sighs> So peaceful. Alright, come on. Let's take you to a proper bed. Let me just put my mans underneath you. Just gonna grab your legs. Alright. I'm gonna put your arms around me. There we go. Let's get you upstairs. Go. Down you go. Here's some blankets to keep you warm. <sighs> You're really out. <sighs> You're so beautiful. Gosh, what did I do to deserve a beautiful, caring, kind girl? I should probably let you sleep. But I also just want to sit here and watch over you. Peacefully resting. You really do deserve it. You work so hard. Raina Hunter, Chief Medical Specialist. The best medic we have. And you're only in high school. I don't know how you do it. You're gifted. That's why you're the best medic, I mean. I mean, you're just special in every way possible. I don't have the words for it, but I... But I see it. 
with my own eyes. I love you. I love you so much, Raina. I love the smell of your hair. It always smells like roses. It's so silky smooth. I love your light green eyes, your smooth skin, your dimples. <laughs> what am I saying? I'm totally soothing over you. You make me feel safe. You make me feel calm with how everything is going. You're just about the only thing that can keep me from losing myself. I'm so grateful I met you. I am grateful for everything you've done for me. You stuck by me through pretty much everything. My parents, school, the unit. Every single mission I've been on so far. Everything. I don't know what I would do without you. Without you. I would be so lost. You're so good to me, not just to me, but to everyone at the unit. You're so kind, you're helpful and caring, devoted to helping others, passionate about what you do. I see it in everyone at work. They always look up to you. You're a beacon of hope to these people, to the community, albeit we are sworn to keep our identities a secret. I'll never know who you really are. But whenever we are in need of help, you're always there. And when you show up, it always gets better. The unit looks up to the agents like they're heroes, but really, the real hero is you. It's you, my love. It was always you. So whenever you're stressed, just look at everyone else that looks up to you. I'm sure that'll keep you moving forward. I love you so much. Raina? Oh, baby, I am so sorry. I didn't mean to wake you up. You were out when I got home, hon. Did you have a busy day at work? You did? Oh, baby, close your eyes, hon. Do you want me to get you something? Nothing? Okay. Why am I on the floor? <laughs> no reason. I just wanted to look at your beautiful, sleepy face. <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll get in bed with you. Let me just... Ah. Hi, beautiful. <laughs> How is work, sweetheart? Yeah. I heard there was this big casualty event down in Liberia. There were 20 civilians hurt. Was it all serious? Oh, just minor injuries? That's good. Did you have help? The fire department came by. That's good. But I'm sure you could have done it all by yourself. You're the best. <laughs> I know. Hey, what's wrong, baby? I know you're tired. Here, I'm gonna give you a really tight hug. <clears throat> yeah. <sighs> you work so hard for us. For everyone. Don't ever give up, okay? I know it's tough, Raina, I know. Our jobs demand so much of us. But you are so resilient and you persevere through the toughest challenges this job throws at you. 
even more so when me and the team go on our missions. Just close your eyes, Reyna. I'm here. By your side, always. I am always going to be here whenever you need me. Shh. Don't say anything. Just rest. Just rest. I love the smell of your hair. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm keeping you awake. I'm just... I'm just in love with you so much. Even though we live together. We barely spend time with each other because we're so busy. Just let me love you. <laughs> Gosh, you're so beautiful. Sleep well. Sweet dreams, my love. Have you guys seen Rena anywhere? Or any of the medical staff? I tried calling Rena earlier. It went straight to voicemail. <sighs> yeah, you're right, Henry. But they've been on that humanitarian mission for hours. They should have reported back in. Well, Saul said he had something for us. Maybe it's about Reyna and the others. Look, if something happens, we will be there for them, no doubt. I have faith in them. Now, where is the director? Director, there you are. Please tell me you have something for us. They haven't reported back from their humanitarian mission in a couple of hours. They were... What? She's what? Th that's... That's not possible. How is that... How is that possible? That's impossible. How could they have been kidnapped? Just tell me we have a location. We do? Then let's go get them. Sir? Yes, sir. My head is focused. I'm focused. Don't worry, sir. I understand, sir. I won't let you down. Now, come on, team. Let's go. I am calm, Davish. Sorry. Look, you don't have to worry about me. I know, Henry. I know. Guys, stop worrying about me. We will get them back. Henry, Davish, Quintus, I will do everything I can to get Reyna and her team back. We will do everything we can. Now, let's stay focused or we'll lose them. Sir? Yes, sir, I'm coming. Go on, guys, I'll catch up. Yes, sir, I understand. I won't let my feelings compromise me. I'll be sure of it. Understood, sir. We'll get it done. We're 60 seconds from the insertion point. Yeah, me too, Henry. I hope they're all okay. Alright, listen up, team. The target building is two stories with two infill points. The main doors and the north stairs. We're inserting at landing point Alpha. That's south of the main building. Castle team will insert 200 meters north of the building at landing point Bravo and go up the second floor. Whichever team has secured the hostages will exfil them to HLZ Delta for extraction. This is a hostage rescue. Watch your shots. 30 seconds! 30 seconds! Let's get them back, Raven team. Move out. On me, team.
Expect hostiles from this point on, team. Archangel 1, this is Raven 01. You got eyes on us? Copy that, Archangel. Any thermal signatures from inside the building? Roger, no thermal signatures. Hey, Henry, looks like your girlfriend back at HQ is losing her touch. Huh. Roger that, Castle Team. We are approaching the main doors. We'll breach on my mark. Alright, here's the door. Stack up. This is Raven 01. Raven Team is set at the south entrance, standing by. Alright, guys. Castle Team is set. 01 to all call signs. Breach in 3, 2, 1. Breach! Clear out these rooms. Kitchen side clear. Move into the hallway. Roger that, Castle Team. Negative on the hostages on our end either. Guys, there's a basement here. Stack up on me. This is 01. Proceeding to the basement floor of the building. On me, guys. You hear that? I hear voices. Doors locked. Stand by. Three, two, one. Breaching! Gun! Secure the room. This is Raven 01 to all call signs. I have four confirmed hostages. Hey. Hey, 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 hey. Where's Raina? Where is she? Raina! No, 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 no. Baby? Baby. Oh, no, no. Oh, my God. Archangel 01, this... This is Raven 01. Requesting immediate medevac to HLC Delta. I have one wounded. Jesus. Baby, stay with me. No. No, she's bleeding. She's... They've... They've... Ah, oh, shit. Shit, shit, shit. I'm going to take her outside. Henry, get these people out of here. Lead us out. Baby? Baby, please wake up. No, no, no. No. Roger that. We're exfilling the building now. We'll be there. Castle team, set security at HLZ Delta. No, she's not okay. She has severe wounds. She might have internal bleeding. Whoever did this, they beat her. Baby, please wake up. Baby, you hear that? You're going home, baby. Baby? Put her on the litter. Carefully. Gently, gently. Henry, get the rest on board. I have to be with her. What? What do you mean I can't? She needs me. <sighs> Screw our orders. I'm going with her. You take the next healer out of here. I'm coming on board. Give me some space. Just hold on, baby. Just hold on. We're going home. Are you okay? Raina? Sweetheart? No, 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 no. It's me, baby. It's me. It's me. Shh. Shh. It's okay. You're safe now. You're safe. You're here. Back at the unit, in the medical bay, look. Yes, yes, you're okay, baby, you're safe. The others? They're okay. They're okay. The others are next door, getting treated. One of your specialists said your wounds will heal in time and that you can expect to be back in a couple of weeks. The director said to take as much time as you need. Here, drink some water. Baby, I am, I am so sorry. I'm so sorry. Because you and your staff were kidnapped and, and, and I wasn't there. I was too late and you were, it is my fault, Reyna. I should have come with you on that mission. If I was there, maybe, there was something I could have done. Me and the team could have protected you guys. It prevented all of this from happening. I don't know what would happen if we didn't get there on time. What if... 
I'm sorry, baby. You're right. You're right. Nothing worse happened. But I feel responsible that you're here. Beaten up. I'm so grateful that you're alive. If something had happened, I would never, ever forgive myself. And I would have lost myself. Without you, I would have... I know, Reyna. I'm just... I'm just so sorry. I'm so sorry for not being there when you needed me. We... We couldn't find the people responsible for this. Stella in the Intel Center is doing everything she can to track them down. And once she does, me and the team are going back there to get justice for you and your staff. Whoever they are, they deserve to feel as much pain as you have. Even more. I'm sorry, Raina, you're right. I shouldn't have said that. I don't understand why someone would do this to you. You want me to stay with you? But what if Stella finds them? I need to be there. Okay. You're right. Castle team will probably be sent out instead of Raven team. The director thought I could be compromised. Okay. I won't leave your side. I'm staying. Oh. I forgot. I brought something for you. It's... Guys, you're all here. She's okay, she just needs to rest. Is that soup from the cafeteria, Quintus? They made it for her and the others? That's nice. We're all here for you, Reyna. We're here if you need us. No one messes with you or anyone. What's that, Henry? The inventory list for the medical bay. Oh, Jesus, Henry. She doesn't need paperwork. <laughs> yeah, me and the team took count on what's left in your stockpiles after the medical team used them. I know you like to keep track of your things. Jeez, Henry, put that away. And what do you have, Davish? Marigold flowers. That's Raina's favorite. Thank you, guys, for being here for her team will always be here for you. Thanks, guys. If you don't mind, I would like a moment with Raina in private. Thanks. I'll see you later. What is this, sweetheart? I'm okay. I'm just happy you're okay. Still, I still feel responsible for everything that's happened. All the training the unit gave me couldn't prepare me for this. Oh, right, I did have something for you. I know you just got shot with gifts from the team, but... Here, I'll open it for you. It's noodles. For you, sweetheart. I was at the store and brought all the food I needed to make it, and I was hoping we could eat it together when you got back from your mission. I'll set it aside for you, for later. I'll be here with you. I'm not leaving your side. I love you, baby. Reyna? Baby? She fell asleep. She needs it more than anyone else. I know you said it's not my fault, but I wasn't there to protect you. Never again will I leave your side. Just like how you never left mine. I'll stay here for you. As long as you need. And when you need me, I'll be here. By your side. Alright. That's that. And that. Alright then. Napkins, utensils, plates, and I feel like I'm forgetting something. Alright, the candle. Nice. Well, isn't this a romantic setup? Now, time to get Rena. Huh. 
Huh, this collared blue plaid shirt is actually pretty nice today, and the jeans feel pretty tight for some reason. Okay, <laughs> never mind that now. <sighs> and... Oh! Wow. Reyna, you look absolutely breathtaking. <laughs> that is such a beautiful sweatshirt. You just look... Wow. Okay, okay. I'll stop staring. I'm sorry, honey. You just look amazing. Come on. Dinner's finally ready. I tried my best with the decor, and especially the food. But sit down. Make yourself comfortable, baby. I'll bring out the noodles. And can you make sure the hot pot is still on, sweetheart? Thank you. Here you go. One bowl of noodles with shrimp, squid, and beef, just like you wanted. And this one's for me. Let me just turn up the hot pot a bit. There's bean sprouts, extra beef, salmon, and some vegetables. Just take whatever you want, hon. It's all for you. Enjoy, sweetheart. How's work today? Not much going on. That's good. What did the director say to you? Not much either. He just told you to take it easy. Well, that's good, sweetheart. That's good. You've been at it pretty hard. You definitely need to request some time off. <laughs> I'm sorry. We need to get some time off. You're right, hon. How's school going on so far? Yeah, I know we both go to the same school, but we barely talk about it afterwards. I just walk you to class. I don't really know what's going on with you and your classes. Mrs. York, handing out insane tests. Well, becoming a medic, a nurse, doctor, isn't easy. Did you pass them? That's great. I'm proud of you, hon. Me? School's okay. I'm doing okay in my classes, except for algebra, because I suck at algebra. Other than that, school is just... okay. Oh. You mean socially? Well... I have you. That's all I need. Just you. You keep me company as always. Oh. Well, there's Carter... But I haven't spoken to Carter in a bit because I heard he's focused on becoming the student president. Jakeem is focused on football. They have a major coming up at the end of this month. And everyone else just faded. I don't really talk to anyone else, except for you. But I don't need any more friends. I have you, my lovely girlfriend. Don't give me that look, sweetheart. I know, I'm sorry. I just haven't been able to reconnect with anyone else ever since mom and dad died. And with the unit always calling on us, time doesn't seem to be on our side. You're right. I probably should go hang out with Carter and the others. Probably just reach out or something. <laughs> I know, baby. You're always right. But I've been hanging out with Julio a little bit. We've been noticing something weird about the school recently. I'm not sure if you noticed it. Oh, it's this weird group at school. Activist type sort of things. Yeah, they have this cheesy name. True Eagles. Because Osborne High School's mascot is Eagles. Just a bunch of disgruntled seniors and graduates, I think. I don't think much of them. Yeah, they had this protest recently. It didn't stay long. Anyway, how are the noodles? I didn't add that much spice to yours. I know you don't like it all too much. Thank you, hon. You're almost done? Jeez, you ate that pretty fast. I'm a slow eater, okay? Don't make fun of me. Babe, I'm trying to savor the flavor. These are the best noodles that i made so far. <laughs> Baby, we should really go somewhere this weekend. 
Just you and me. Remember, we talked about it a couple weeks ago. It's almost fall soon. I know you just got back, but we should just disappear for a weekend. You and me. Away from school, from work. Where do you want to go? New York? Maryland? Florida? Or what about California? We'll take my dad's truck. Hell, we'll be gone for like a week. Come on, baby. The unit will still be here after we come back. So will school. Please. Pretty please. Christmas time? Okay. That's a promise? <laughs> I love you, baby. Well, I think I did pretty well on dinner, if I say so myself. Maybe a little bit more? Maybe. Yeah, you're right. Next time, sweetheart. I'll take care of the dishes. You go upstairs, wash up. Baby? What are you doing behind me? Oh. <laughs> You're so cute. Oh, and bold too. Putting your hands around my waist. Baby, not now. Baby, stop. I'm cleaning the dishes. The water will get everywhere. Yes, I'm going to make a mess if you don't stop. Oh. You're going to make a mess out of me, huh? Miss Hunter, I don't recall it being that time of hour yet. Oh, baby, stop. You know what kissing me in the neck does to me. Baby, what's got into you? <sighs> okay, let me drop my hands. Come here. <sighs> you give the best hugs. Hi, beautiful. I love you very much. Yes, I will kiss you. Yes. Okay, let me carry you. Just wrap your arms around me. There you go. Good girl. Are you sleepy? Yes, you are. The food is kicking in, isn't it? Here you go. Down you go. You want me to get in bed with you? But what about the dishes? Okay, fine. Tomorrow it is. Come here, baby. Oh, you're on top of me now. Hi, sexy. Can I feel your body? I can take your sweatshirt off? But what if it'll be cold? Okay, baby. Wow. You have such an amazing body, love. <laughs> I won't stare. You're beautiful, as always, love. Did I mention you're such a great kisser? 
<laughs> yes, baby. Okay, okay. I'll, I'll shut up. <laughs> oh, getting frisky, I see. Here, I'll help you take off my shirt off, too. I love you. I love you so much. Why is my heart beating so fast? Because you just make my heart go crazy. You're my everything, Reyna. You make me whole. I love you too. What the? Who's calling? It's Henry. Why is he calling? Henry? What is it? What? There was a shooting at Old Town? Okay, I'm on the way. Is the rest of the team en route? Okay, yeah. Yeah, I'll be there. Yeah, Rana's with me. Yeah, I'll tell her. Okay, I'll see you there. There were shots fired at the parking garage in Old Town. Henry and the others are responding. They want you there too. I know, baby, but it's the job. I'll drop you off at headquarters so you can set up with your medical staff. I know, I know, baby. It's horrible. But this is what we do. Yeah, Henry had to be the one to interrupt our little session. <laughs> okay, let's go. Henry, Quintus, Davish, I'm here. Yeah, Raina's on the way. She's back at HQ gathering her things. Yes, Henry, in fact, you did interrupt our little personal time. Quit laughing, Quintus. It's not like you have anyone waiting at home for you. You're right. You're right, Davish. We should stay on track. Alright, team. Let's get to work. 